Hi, Dr. Goldberg here, continuing our internal medicine lecture series. Today we're going to talk about pulmonary nodules. Pulmonary nodules, we see obviously many chest x-rays that have pulmonary nodules. Uh, a nice mnemonic for pulmonary nodules is uh, CITGO, as in CITGO gas station, C-I-T-G-O. Uh, C stands for collagen vascular disease, such as rheumatoid disease, such as Wegener's granulomatosis. Uh, I, of course, stands for infection. Uh, this could be TB, atypical TB, fungal disease, such as blastomycosis, histoplasmosis, cryptococcosis, etc. Uh, coccidiomycosis, if you're from the southwest U.S. Uh, but also, uh, even bacteria like nocardia certainly can cause a pulmonary nodule. T stands for tumor. So, uh, lung cancer, obviously high on the uh, list. Metastatic uh, disease to the lung, plasmacytomas, uh, hamartomas, carcinoid, uh, you know, the long, there's a long list, but certainly lung cancer, metastatic cancer to the lung are, are, are high here. G stands for granulomatous disease. Um, granulomas can be caseating, they can be non caseating, uh, but uh, uh, if they're non caseating, they can be associated with uh, sarcoidosis. So O stands for other, and obviously sarcoidosis is on that list. Uh, so remember that mnemonic. It's a nice mnemonic. Um, the other thing we need to know about pulmonary nodules is the Fleischner criteria, which is basically on the basis of size, how often we need to follow these nodules up, especially if we have really small nodules. Uh, if they're less than 4 millimeters, <clears throat> we recheck a CT scan in 12 months. If they're 4 to 6 millimeters, we recheck in 6 months and then 18 months. If they're 6 to 8 millimeters, we check uh, at 3 months, 6 months, 12 months, that range. Uh, uh, and then if they're greater than 8 millimeters, uh, they need really close follow-up uh, possible. You know, obviously PET scanning, uh, making sure it's not a malignancy. Following up the CT scan in 3 months, 9 months, you know, 12 months. Uh, really being on top of these, you know, considering a bronchoscopy, looking for speculated appearance, you know, that type of thing. Um, PPD skin testing, etc., on all these nodules is, is reasonable uh, once they get to be certainly over six millimeters. Pulmonary consultation would be also helpful. So, uh, good summary on pulmonary nodules. Uh, remember the mnemonic of CITGO, remember Fleischner uh, criteria. Uh, and uh, that'll uh, help you as you try to uh, differentiate these nodules. Thanks, Dr. Goldberg, signing off.